Evan and Amanda have spent years getting to know each other, and we now bear witness of their relationship as we come today. It's you, it's me, it's us. This is something you told me from the very beginning. Through life's obstacles, it's always been us breezing through them with each other by our sides. We have many memories together, but I think today is gonna to be by far my favorite. Today is the day that I take your last name. From this day forward, I vow to love you forever, unconditionally, to be open and honest. I look forward to our future and the new memories we're about to make. I knew very early on that this was different, this was going to be something that was going to lead to more and, and it was just a feeling that I had then. And people tell you, you know, when you know, you know, and you know, until you find that, you don't, you don't really realize that and then when it happens, you're like, yeah, you know, people are right, you do know when you know. You are my person. You make me the best version of myself. You keep me sane. You know when to put me in my place, and for that, I thank you. Evan, you truly are a gift from God, and I'm so thankful our paths crossed. From this day forward, I am yours, and you are mine. No matter what we do going through life, I just want her to always know that I'm gonna be there right by her side, even crazy things like having a wedding and decor coming in wrong or the wrong size, wrong this, wrong that. I mean, I'm always here. We're always going to make it work. We'll always have each other. We come here today to honor the marriage of Amanda and Evan, and we welcome the friends and the family. Thank you for coming. It's not the beginning of a new relationship, but a knowledge of the next chapter of their lives together. Do you, Evan, take Amanda to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold? in sickness and in health, in good times and bad times, for richer, for poor, keeping yourselves unto her for as long as you both shall live. I do. Do you, Amanda, take Evan to be your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold through sickness and in health, in good times and bad, for richer, for poor, keeping yourselves unto him for as long as you both shall live. I do. With this ring, I do wed. With this I, ring, I do wed. By the authority vested in me, by the great state of West Virginia, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Evan, you may now kiss your bride. <laughs>
I've never seen my sister as happy as she is. She's so comfortable with Evan. She's finally learned to be comfortable in her own skin, and I truly think Evan has brought out the best version of my sister. I want to wish them a lifetime full of blessings and happiness. Here's to a lifetime. Cheers. We got everything we need. I do have to say, uh, just how lucky you are. You are leaving. You will leave here today with a wife who is beautiful, loving, and caring. And Amanda, how lucky you are as well. You will leave here today having gained a lovely dress and a wonderful bouquet of flowers. <laughs> All jokes aside, I'm very happy for you guys. You guys complete one another. I've never seen my brother so happy. Um, you have found a good one. I'm glad to have you in the family, Amanda. I love you both. Congratulations. So let's raise our glasses to cheers and to the bride and groom. And now, on our own with our hope in the clouds, we're starting to see that we're on to something. Feel it coming now. Here we go!